to find a better way to end the regular season as number nine Oregon State holds on in double overtime to beat an upset state of mind Arizona Wildcat crew 65 to 60 with Joan Bombasini. I am Cindy Brunson and boy you cannot talk about Oregon State and Arizona battling without talking about Ari McDonald. Ari McDonald is so tough. I mean, she does it so many different ways and shortest player on the floor, but finds a way to get to the basket so many different times. But tonight, one of her teammates, McBride, really stepped up. McBride had a season high 20 points and a career high four triples. She was impressive and very excited. She was so instrumental. In why the Wildcats battled back, but Pivik, holy cow. Her seventh double-double of the season. She 21 is. points, 14 rebounds, five dimes. She does it so many different ways from the inside, the outside. And then her teammate also, Grimmick here, stepping out, doing it on defense, doing it on offense, setting screens and finishing down low. 14 points, seven rebounds, and five huge blocks, particularly late to ensure this Oregon State victory as OSU beats Arizona for an 11th straight time. Oregon State celebrating its first win in an overtime this season along the way. Well, that'll do it for us from Tucson. We thank you so much for watching Pac-12 Women's Basketball with us, and we can't wait to see you in Las Vegas for the Pac-12 Women's Basketball Tournament.